Getting the required dose of vitamins is essential, bodybuilder or not. But when you're on a strict diet and focused on bulking up, obtaining a balanced vitamin intake alongside your protein shake and steamed broccoli isn't always easy. Supplementing has always been a part of weight training. We focus on the obvious ones like protein, thermogenic, creatine, and energy boosters when we talk about it. But this time, let's talk about the best vitamins for bodybuilders, some of which you might not expect. As we all know, vitamins are essential for muscle growth and repair. They act at the cellular level, assisting in oxidative stress reduction, collagen production, and membrane repair. They also aid in the development of muscle mass and structural strength. Vitamins are one of the most fundamental and well-known supplements. After all, many of us have been taking them since we were children, and selecting one as an adult appears to be simple enough. Until you start shopping and comparing the products. With so many different kinds accessible online and at the store, it's challenging to decide which one will be worth your money. Bodybuilders and other athletes spend countless hours in the gym exercising. Those who compete keep a strict diet to become leaner and more defined. It's important not to restrict your caloric intake too much, as this can inhibit you from growing muscle. Sports nutrition can help in these areas by consuming a lot of protein. Many multivitamin supplements on the market aren't that helpful. Most of the time, these multivitamin products do not provide the nutritious values mentioned on the labels, or they contain hazardous filler components that you should avoid. That is why you must understand how to choose the best vitamins for bodybuilding to stay healthy and reach your fitness goals risk-free. Now, let's get right into the 10 vitamins essential for bodybuilding. Vitamin D. Vitamins are nutrients that the body cannot produce. Thus, they must be obtained through diet. On the other hand, our body may generate vitamin D in response to sun exposure. A person can also increase their vitamin D intake by eating certain foods or taking supplements. Vitamin D is necessary for various reasons, including bone and tooth health. It helps our body protect against multiple ailments, including type 1 diabetes. The vitamin also helps maintain healthy bones and supports protein synthesis, both of which are required to remain healthy and strong. Vitamin D also aids in nutrient absorption, mood regulation, and insulin production. Because we acquire vitamin D with the help of sunlight, it has earned the nickname the sunshine vitamin. However, it isn't easy to obtain the required amount if you work indoors or do not live in a sunny state. But eating plenty of fatty fish like tuna, mackerel, salmon, soy milk, cow liver, egg yolks, and cheese will help maintain this necessary vitamin on a high level. Vitamin B12. This is an essential B vitamin for the health of nerve tissue, brain function, and the creation of red blood cells. Vitamin B12 is also known as cobalamin. When vitamin B12 levels fall below the body's requirements, a deficit or insufficiency occurs. If left untreated, this can cause various symptoms and possibly irreparable brain disorders. Vitamin B12, like all other B vitamins, is a water-soluble vitamin. The body may store vitamin B12 for up to four years and excrete any excess or undesired amount in the urine. Vitamin B12 is the most abundant and structurally complex vitamin. It occurs naturally in animal products such as meat and eggs, and it can be manufactured through bacterial fermentation synthesis. Because vitamin B12 helps produce red blood cells, it is an essential part of the muscle growth. You can get this from eating fish and dairy. Those who dislike eating meat or fish are more likely to be deficient in specific nutrients. So make sure to include vegetables, milk, soybeans, and some fortified cereals in your diet. It would help if you also considered taking a vitamin B12 supplement. Vitamin B3. Fitness is good for your heart, and it also helps you lose weight. The bad news is that poor nutrition can undo most of your work. Vitamins and minerals are important for the health of your muscles. Make sure that these vitamins in particular are part of any fitness goals that you set out to achieve. Niacin is a vitamin B3 that belongs to the B group of vitamins. The B vitamins help the production of carbohydrates into glucose or energy. They are required to keep our liver, skin, and eyes healthy. The B group also contributes to nervous system functionality. 
Niacin, in particular, is vital for helping the adrenal glands produce hormones, improving circulation, and reducing inflammation. When B3 was initially discovered, it was used primarily as an anti-inflammatory, assisting in continuing to assist patients suffering from joint stiffness and arthritis. It causes blood vessels to dilate, soothing effect on stiffness, and also niacin has been used for a long time to help lower cholesterol. There are some risks, but you can avoid them if you know what you're doing. Vitamin B3 or niacin helps your muscles grow and gives you better pumps, so getting enough of this vitamin is essential. So many bodybuilders and fitness models eat foods rich in this vitamin before they do photo shoots because it helps them look good. Bananas and eggs are both excellent sources of niacin. Vitamin B6 Vitamin B6 is a vitamin that helps the central nervous system and the body's metabolic process. It turns food into energy and helps make neurotransmitters like serotonin and dopamine. When you eat food, your body needs vitamin B6. The vitamin is one of the eight B vitamins. People need this group of vitamins so that their cells can work the right way. They help with metabolism, the creation of blood cells, and the health of the cells they live in. As pyridoxone, vitamin B6 is a water-soluble vitamin. It means it can be found in water. Because the body doesn't store vitamin B6, people need to get enough of this vitamin every day. Is there a trend here? The B vitamin family is a big help as you build muscle and repair it. You want to get enough of these vitamins because they can help your body make red blood cells and keep your nitric oxide levels healthy. It will help you performance and endurance. Add fish to your food to get this into your body. Even fatty fish like albacore tuna and salmon. Also chickpeas and bananas that are good for you. Suppose you don't like beef liver or fish that is very rich. In that case, chickpeas and bananas are your best friend. One can of chickpeas, for example, has more than 55% of the recommended amount of B6 in it, which is good for you. Thinking about taking a B6 vitamin too, to help you stay healthy. Vitamin E. Many people know that vitamin E can help your skin look better, but it isn't just for your skin. Taking vitamin E not only slows down aging, but also helps our bodies get rid of metabolic waste. This waste is harmful to our health and can cause long-term illness. When we exercise, we put our bodies through oxidative stress. The good news is this vitamin can help repair some of the damage done by the free radicals. Nuts have. Vitamin A. This vitamin is the best because it helps your body make protein and make glycogen. It also allows our eyes fight free radicals and makes our bones strong and healthy, among other things. However, vitamin A can be depleted by many things in the environment, including alcohol, diabetes, and low-fat diets. It is why it's essential to get enough vitamin A from your food. Vitamin A can be found in eggs, fatty fish, and milk. It's good for you to eat fatty fish. There are also potatoes and carrots that contain vitamin A. Vitamin C. Since they were little, many people have taken this vitamin because their moms told them to. Most people use vitamin C to boost their immune systems and increase their antioxidant levels. This is because vitamin C is suitable for both. Taking this vitamin can even help you get back to your old self, which is very important if you're working out. A lot of tasty foods have it. You can find it in tomatoes, citrus fruits, and leafy greens. Omega-3 fatty acids. Many recent human studies say that omega-3 fatty acids, like those found in fish, can affect how skeletal muscle responds to exercise and nutrition. They can cut down on post-workout muscle soreness as well. They also help our cardiovascular, eyes, joints, brain, and skin health. Omega-3s have been shown to speed up recovery and boost muscle growth. Omega-3 fatty acids are found in walnuts, eggs, fishes like mackerel and sardines, and avocados. You may also take a fish oil supplement every day to get more omega-3s in your body. Vitamin B2 People who want to make significant gains at the gym need to take this one. Also, this supplement can do wonders after your workout. It can lessen the soreness that comes with a good workout. It helps you get back in the gym more quickly rather than having to wait a long time for your muscles to heal. You can find this in fish, beef, milk, and lamb. Vegans can choose from other things. Vitamin B9 
folate or folic acid. Vitamin B9 is essential for muscle growth because it helps the body make more of it. You should know this. A folic acid is a form of vitamin B9 made from food. On the other hand, folate is vitamin B9 that comes from food, according to Breaking Muscle. You can also buy this in supplement form. For physical activity to make energy, folate and vitamin B12 must be used as coenzymes. It helps with growth, creating new cells, and repairing cells and tissues that have been damaged or harmed by something. You can also get a lot of it from foods like avocados and spinach, but it's essential to take a supplement every day if you can. A lot of vitamins play a big part in muscle growth and repair. Their job is to help the body's cells work better, reduce oxidative stress, make collagen, and repair membranes. They also help with muscle mass and structural strength. So, which of these vitamins did you never expect to be essential in bodybuilding? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below.